Hello ladies and gentlemen, my name is Tomasz and in today's video we're going to talk about the most common error connected with arrays. So, let's start from the beginning, from the background story. One day I found an issue on the Stack Overflow when the guy posted his code, simple code, and asked what is wrong. He, he declared an array, he, uh, he created an array, as you can see from the first uh, column of his worksheet, and wanted to see the value of the first element. But he got an error. The runtime error 9. What is wrong here? He just forgot about dimensions that even if you create an array just only from the one column it has two parameters rows and columns. If you're not sure what is going on, what is happening, you can add uh, your array to the watch and you can analyze this and as you can see the first element of the array has those two dimensions rows and columns uh, so the first element of uh, the array having two dimensions have has a value of one and for the second two, third, three. So, how to fix that issue? Just only to type the second dimension. And the code printed out the value one. So it's, it's good. What you need to do if you uh, want to print out the elements of your array just using the one parameter. If you know that uh, your array is created from only one column, you can transpose your array. So simply just add worksheet function transpose, put the uh, uh, array name in the middle of the brackets. Uh, let's leave here the breakpoint. Go and in the watch you can see that we can't go deeper in any of the elements so the only dimension uh, is left is, uh, is rows. Yeah. So, the first element, first row, value 1, etc. So, to sum up, if you declare your array the same way as your range, you always need to remember about two dimensions, even if it's created just from, from just only one column. Your array got two dimensions, rows, and columns. In that case just uh, your second dimension have only value 1 but uh, if you want to work with this array calling out uh, with only one parameter you can transpose the array and then the method from the beginning is working once again here. So if you're not transposing you need to add the second dimension, go, everything is okay, no error, but if you want to work with only one parameter and you have one column array you can transpose it and it's working correctly too. Okay that's it. I hope you will remember that and won't have any problem in the future like on that. 
thank you for watching thank you for listening please leave a like please subscribe comment i will appreciate any feedback from you guys please visit also my website simplexlvba.com um once again thank you and see you in the next video bye bye